welcome back to Todd Family Farm. Welcome to Fall Farmathon episode nine, I think. Is that right? I think it is. So today we are back up here at the river bottom. Yesterday we got started up here. We got about 30 acres done yesterday, but it was the hardest 30 acres to do. So today we have 50 acres left to do up here, which I'm hoping to get at least most of that done, if not all of it done today, which is pretty ambitious, but I'd like to get all of it done today. And we have rain coming in tomorrow afternoon. I think we might have a little bit of time to work tomorrow, but we definitely have a lot of rain coming in tomorrow night and then Thursday and Friday. So we'd like to get as much done up here as we can before the rain hits um, and get this done. And then we just have what is back home because this is a river bottom gets rained on it holds water like a lot so we definitely want to get this off before the rain and uh, we brought the 84 up here today with another auger cart so we have two auger carts up here now um, dad's running the semi I'm running the combine Emma's running an auger cart Papa's running an auger cart so we've got a good operation going up here and should be good so we got the small fields done yesterday we just have this nice big field left and we got some end rows taken off yesterday we're gonna get the rest of those taken off today and then it should be just some nice straight rows which I'm very excited about so it's very uh stressful I guess you could say doing end rows right up here it's right next to Manats so there's like a lot of trucks and stuff but there's power poles right along the field and power lines and it's like very very nerve-wracking combining uh you got an auger sticking out um that you can just swing around and hit on a power pole very easily so um i will i'm very glad to get away from that and just get on some nice straight rows see how much we can get done today We got all the end rows off, so we are now cutting across the middle of the field. Um, yeah, I'm very confident that I'm going to make it all the way to the end with and without having to dump. So that's good because then I won't have to cut in anywhere. Um, Emma's behind me in the auger cart. I don't know if you can see. There's my backup camera. It's extremely dusty, so I can't see much right now. But Emma is behind me. She's following me and Papa's at the other, other end of the field and Dad should be getting back with the semi pretty soon and we'll have a nice semi load for him so they'll just load him up and then he can head back out. So I've received word from Mom that lunch is on the way which is wonderful news because I am starving. Okay everybody, it's going really well. Um, I'm starving, and lunch has been delivered, so I've got it right down there. It was actually delivered like an hour ago, but I've been so busy, it's just been non-stop, that I have not had a chance to eat yet. Dad was gonna get in and run the combine a little bit, so I could have a break and enjoy lunch a little bit. But by the time he got back, we already had both auger carts full, and it was just putting those on the semi, and he got going again, so... Um, he, uh, I will just eat on the go sometime, and that's fine, but it's going really well, and I will keep you guys updated. done. Um, I'm heading to this other section now and yeah getting along really good. It's about 5 30. Not sure how long we'll work but I'd love to get this field done today. Everybody. 
we're getting along good. Um, we got so much done today. We got all of this, and then on that side there's a bunch, and then we just have this patch left, which shouldn't take too long to finish. I want to get it done today. I'm not sure if we're going to go into or not. We'll see how late everybody wants to work. It's about 6 o'clock, but I wanted to talk about the sun. This is like the worst part of the day for harvesting. It's like my favorite part of the day when the sun is like going down. But when you're harvesting, it's so bad because it's just so bright and that's like, you can't see anything. So trying to line up on auger carts and try not to overflow auger carts and everything, it's very challenging and not very fun. And then driving into the sun, thankfully these rows are north and south, so I'm not, never have to drive directly into the sun, but yeah, it's just not very fun. So I'm gonna try to get this full without <laughs> overflowing it here. We'll see. I should probably turn my camera off and focus here. Okay, everybody. We are shutting it down for the night. It's like 6.30. Um, we could have finished, but... It's not going to rain tomorrow, so there's really no need to. And I was kind of campaigning to finish tonight. Okay, the struggles of being five foot two and putting the parking brake on the combine are like very, very real. So, okay, gonna call that good. Um, nine loads today. Nine loads today. Okay. Um, I think we're good. Down, down, down. Um, I was really campaigning to finish today, like get 80 acres done in two days, but um, yeah, everybody else kind of wanted to quit for the night, so that's what we did, and we'll just finish it up tomorrow. It will not take long, and that'll be a nice little day tomorrow. I am exhausted, so I'm gonna go home, get some supper, get cleaned up, and call it a day and get this field finished up tomorrow. That is going to be it for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and we will see you tomorrow.